Let's get this thing started. Fucking need a coffee. Right, so welcome back to the channel. We have got a Q&A on the cards today. Um, so with my Q&As, I always get people to ask me on Instagram for just any questions that they want to learn about, okay? So I've got a few questions in. Um, let me try to get them up. So, uh, one, two, three. Four, four or five questions, okay, that I'm going to run through. Um, so the first one would be, what is the best thing about being a coach? So for me, I don't know, I just love helping people and love seeing people grow, like, not only, like, in the gym, like, grow with their confidence, like, their mentality, the way they think about things, um, pretty much just being able to help. I just like helping people. Um, I get great satisfaction out of doing it, to be honest with you. Um, okay, so next question. Um, if you could only do five exercises forever, what would they be? So my five exercises would be deadlifts, back squat, so barbell back squat, just squats, um, overhead press, bench press, and pull-ups. Okay, so five there. I just listed five compound movements. So if you bulk all the five compound movements together and do them correctly and do them really well, you will have a very overall rounded physique and it will be, if you stick to the principles of them, you'll be absolutely sailing. Okay, so probably I don't really need any other, if I've just got those five forever, then, you know, why would I need an ex isolation exercise? So those are the five exercises I would do throughout, well, if I couldn't do any other exercises and I could only choose five, then those are the five I could do. All right. Um, next question. So, what's your average spend on on food per week? So, I go shopping every Sunday, and I usually spend around about forty to fifty pounds on groceries. So that includes like meat, meat, veg, um, sauces, carbs. So pasta, rice, whatever it may be. And then I usually spend, if I'm either out or doing something during the day and I'm needing a little bit of a boost and need some food, then I would probably spend, so maybe about 10, 20 pounds. So I'm closer, just shy of 100 pounds a week on food, to be honest, which seems quite excessive. Um, and it is when it could just like prep food and take it with me. But sometimes, you know, you're unprepared. You can't deal with all these things that pop up in life, can you? So, hey. Can't deal with getting hungry when you go shopping, can you? Go shopping? That made no fucking sense! Um, okay, so next question. Um, next question is, what's your favourite go-to meal if you need an extra boost? So, say for example, I am going to the gym and I'm quite hungry. What would my go-to be? So my go-to would probably be a protein bar and then a coffee, just to get a caffeine boost and a little bit of food in me. Um, either that, or if I can't have that, then probably a banana or a handful of nuts if I've got readily available, or or if I go out and buy stuff. Um, other than that, if I train in the mornings, I actually like to have cereal, which I know is quite frowned upon, but um, for me, cereal gives me a bit of a boost, especially if I'm training, say, at like 6 a.m., something like that. Um, but yeah. Um, so those are all the questions that I took from Instagram. If you've got any other questions, please comment down below or have a look at my Instagram feed and drop me a DM. Why not? Be friendly. So make sure you like and subscribe to this video. I hope it I brought a little bit of value. Just another quick video. Um, if you've got any questions, like I said, give me a message. Adios.